Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you on how to create a progress chart. Let me show you my sample, guys. This is my progress chart. Like for example, 45. Okay, it's being changed. What if 75? Okay, 95. Or even 100. Here we go, guys. So, how to do this? If you are still interested, Please watch this video until the end and please subscribe if you have not yet subscribed. <music> Highlight this one guys. And then go to insert. And then select this pie chart. And then do not. So this is the default one. It has changed to 25. Okay, here we go. So now, let us take out this chart title and also the legend. Okay, and also we have to take out the borderline. So, to take out, so click and then go to format and then for the outline, so click no outline. That's it, guys. So, next, let us click this one and then right click, select data. So, for this, we have to edit this one. For example, original. I put original because we will make a new one. Okay, we will add a new one. So, that's the original, and then we will add another one. Let's put feed color. And then, for the series value, let's add a like 22 values. Like this one, comma, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. That's it, guys. And then click OK. Here we go. So, last click OK. So, these are the series value that we have created, all in all, 22. So, next thing to do, click this one, and then let us change the color. Go to fill color, like for example, this color. That's it. And then, next, click, and then, uh, right click, select this change series chart type. Here we go. So there are two options, the two uh, data that we have created. So let us select this guys, the original. So don't worry about this uh, pit color. Click OK. So now, by the way, so this color blue, this is the actual completion, the 25%. So click this, double click. And then uh, you can use this one or also you can use this. But this is accessible, so I have to use this. So, shape fill, and then select this. No fill. That's it. And for this, double click again. I have to change the color. I'll, um, this, was this one, I will select that one. Let us try, guys. 30. Okay. 65. So, next guys, is we have to insert a value. But, take note guys, if you want to insert uh, another information which is embedded to this chart, or, or if you want to move, sorry, if you want to move your chart, the value also will move. To do that, please select the chart, and then click insert. And then sample this one ticks box. So, okay. And then for the value of this, so click this one, and then go to formula bar. Then let's type equals, and then like this one, guys. Actual completion. Enter. Okay. So if we move, okay. So this value also being moved. So let's insert here. 
and then center call sorry this one like 18 and then the font style is one okay let's try again what if 100% okay it's 110% so it's working guys and I think this is enough and if you have some questions you know what to do just comment it down below and if you have not yet subscribed please subscribe that's all thank you and see you to my next video